little bit more hate. Yeah, they're like those people who put the uh, brochures and pamphlets on your door with like little rubber bands, except they're just stuffing them right inside your shirt yeah. pocket. And like the the little opening you have for your letters, they're just yeah. filling. Ooh! Oh! 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 oh. oh. All right. Oh. Okay. All right. Let's so, calm down. Yeah. Sorry, let's stream viewers. We probably heard some of your ears. Hey, let's they're headphone see. users. They deserved it. Uh, you're right. You're right. ATX. Uh. Representing Austin, I suppose? Yes, definitely. Yeah. Austin, Texas. <laughs> uh, looks like they agreed what? to a neutral start after. Wait, what just happened there? Uh, I think that was odd. Yeah, that was strange. Because this looks like... Nah. Okay. So it, it looks like they're in the match. Uh, it's just Hamlin was expecting maybe a neutral start. Oh, oh. wow. An emphatic start to the set. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, but I was going to mention that Hamlin was doing some really cool uh, um, ledge stuff or uh, platform stuff where he was controlling the center of the stage with needles from the platforms. Mm -hmm. That's uh, really, really useful, especially against Marth because he's so good at forcing you to do what he wants. And when you have that needle control, uh, you can actually force him places that he doesn't want to go. Right. The only problem in that situation being that Marth could just stand there and not do anything. Yeah. Uh, which is exactly what happened. And as a result, you know, it wasn't that big of a deal. Oh, wait, no, he power shielded the needles, didn't he? Yeah. That's that's way too cool. Nice, yeah. nice pivot wow. forward smash. Um, and Hamlin looks like he's struggling here. <laughs> One, two, three. Yeah, Hamlin you know, in that first stock, Hamlin got popped up in the air, and MT did not let him down. Yeah, and Hamlin uh, actually jumps off the stage facing the wrong way, and uh, that prevents him from edge guarding properly. It so does. Hamlin looks like he's, uh, he's wow. not quite ready. Looks like he wanted a hand warmer, or he needed a hand warmer, and he didn't get it. Hamlin, uh, wow, he's getting rocked this game. Oh, Ooh. and just as I say that. Yeah. Hits him with just out of nowhere. Yeah, he sees MT was just uh, waiting for Hamlin to move. Oof. And Hamlin just gives him the back air. Yeah. Knocks him off stage. But good stuff by uh, MT. MT did not get hit by those needles. Hamlin likes doing that. Well, he'll he'll recover and throw the needles to uh, mess up your ledge invincibility. But MT being smart and doesn't get hit by them, times his invincibility correctly. Ooh. Nice. He hit a what? Hap what just happened there is Sheik, uh, when she's at the apex of her jump and she does her fair, can just swat Marth's full shield uh, by punching him right in the tiara. Ooh. Yeah, it hurts. Yeah. And Hamlin with a <coughs> really good down air extension here. Yeah, good Hamlin's actually, uh, you know, he's taking it back. Interesting uh, way to grab the ledge, but it works out. An accident, I guarantee you. Yeah. He was trying to wave land off that platform. Yeah, but uh, it works out. I mean, he it, it ended up the same way because uh, MT was so far away. So, mm -hmm. oh, Hamlin really bringing this back. It yeah. seems like, uh, you know, he got rocked those first two stocks, but I don't know if that was so much because he doesn't know what to do, or if it had a lot more to do with MT just having a really good punish game. So, yeah. it's looking like this could, uh, it's looking like this is going to be a lot more close. Yeah, or a lot closer, I should say. Ooh. Oh, barely just misspaced. outside the tipper. Oh, nice. That was super nice. And Hamlin looking really good. Defending Dallas right now. Well played, Hamlin. Yep. And Hamlin actually bringing back from a clean two-stock deficit. Yeah. Uh, looking really good. Oh, uh, the spot dodge. Yeah. What's going to happen? Are right, he forward throws? That's interesting. Just wants to make him get onto the stage. Oh, that was interesting. Again, uh, needle stalling. Mm -hmm. Something Hamlin really likes to do. And I think it's really good. Uh, Hamlin is really smart. The forward Interesting. smash. Ooh, that what? was really cool. I don't know if that was on purpose. I'm hoping it was, but ooh. I think that cheat players generally never do that forward smash on purpose. Ah, uh, that accidental like air dot weird air dodge thing that happened there yeah. was really unfortunate. And I like what we saw from Hamlin not letting uh, like the first two stocks get to him. Yeah, not at all. Yeah, uh, being really smart and just adapting instead of letting it get to his head and going on tilt. Hamlin, one of those players that has a really, really good mentality. I really like that about Hamlin. Um, I think a lot of Dallas uh, has some mentality issues. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's a little bit of an understatement. But Hamlin, definitely a, a player that uh, accepts his losses and tries to learn from them. Definitely. He also, you know, it also helps that he only really loses to really good players. Mm -hmm. He only really yeah. loses to people who are better than him. Yeah. So... You know, you, there's not much arguing you can do with that. Oh, that was nice. Sick tomahawk. 
Uh, but it's it's easy to make the John that you're better than them and you shouldn't have lost. But Hamlin True. never never uh, thinks like that. Hamlin, ooh, great needle there to catch his uh, double jump, or maybe his up B. But uh, Hamlin never makes that excuse. Hamlin always says, "If I lost that game, it's because I played worse." And he figures out why he's losing. Yeah. And um, so yeah, so we're seeing Hamlin in the lead right now against MT. Yeah. Uh, nice. So the Psypees, uh, the Psypees are interesting because if you're being hit by them, you can just hold down and you'll eventually make it to the ground and you can buffer a shield. Yeah. Um, so side B is really bad and uh, there's a reason that Ken's side Bs don't work anymore. Yeah. Um, but if you just hold on to the shield for Marth's side Bs in particular, almost every single one of Marth's third swings can be shield grab. I actually and think all of them can. And empty going for these forward smashes off of the recovery, but it hasn't been working out so far. Oh my god, that back air killed. Yeah. But, uh. Back air does not look like it's a move that should just, like, kill you like it, that. Yeah, it doesn't. Oh, Wispy is so dumb. Looking for that sick combo, but Wispy does not let it happen. Oh. And MT has actually been uh, having some really good uh, DI out of Hamlin's down throws. Uh, not only not letting him combo out of it, but also when he does get comboed out of it, like when he got up tilted once, he. Uh, oh, good spot dodge. When he. Uh, he got up tilted out of it. He DI'd really far away, so Hamlin couldn't really uh, follow unless he read that DI. True. So good stuff by MT. Yet again, like what we saw in MT versus uh, Mojo, his recoveries are really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's um, he's he's really pushing Marth's recovery to the the absolute max that they they can go. He's just mixing it up in every possible way that he can. Yeah. And, you know, even if it's not a big change, if it's a small change, that's enough to really call it a mix-up. And Hamlin nice. just barely misses the stage. Doing normal getup. Yeah. Normal getup being superior in most cases against Sheik because it allows you to react to her being on her landing on the stage. Yeah. <coughs> Ooh, and uh, Thundercats have come, coming out. Yeah, that was interesting. I wonder if that was supposed to be an up air. Yeah, Either I would way, assume it, it was. It looked dope. Yeah. Uh, but at the end of the day, as long as you knock them up, uh, it's not a huge deal as Marth. Yeah, it's it's uh, as long as you're underneath a sheet, you're you're in a pretty good spot. It's true. Whether you're in the air or you just happen to up smash. And nice movement. It's dead even now. Yeah. Um, but this is of course Hamlin's counter pick, so I'll be interested to see how MT handles Hamlin once he gets a counter pick. Oh, um, nice. His Dreamland is a pretty hard stage for Marth. It is. Platforms are uh, a little bit too high for him to comfortably follow. Yeah, it messes with his follow-ups. Yeah. It's also, you know, a little bit harder to kill uh, yeah, with forward smashes larger. and things like that. Smart uh, edge guard. Or oh, he thought he had a jump. Yeah, smart uh, air dodge by Hamlin, but he doesn't touch ground, and that, that pretty much ends the game. Yeah. And now we have to decide, oh, wow, they got three trophies. Hamlin looks like he's soul-searching. Project M. Um, interesting. We had a hooligan up here. Oh. And Hamlin, uh, going back to Dreamlands, obviously he feels like this is his best counterpick, but also Hamlin does like uh, take people back to stages that he's lost on to see what, what exactly he's losing to mm -hmm. and trying to adapt to that. Oh. Ooh. Ah. He disappeared. Yeah. MT got lost. Yeah, looks like MT somehow misplaced or misjudged uh, how how far he could recover. Mm. Nice. MT is playing the ledge options really well. Whenever Hamlin does get the does get the ledge, he almost never gets away with it scot free. Yeah. MT uh, mostly res knowing that he can just respond to what Hamlin decides to do. Yeah. Uh, just doing like regular get up and then seeing what happens. Nice. And Hamlin, I think, was expecting an edge guard, maybe, hoping that he would get hit after the air dodge, but it doesn't work out. Oh, oh Wispy helping out Hamlin's combo a little bit. <laughs> Interesting D tilt. Spot dodge down smash being Ooh. actually pretty safe. That crispy uh, dash dance away and then dash dance back to punish Hamlin. Mm. Not quite a tipper. Oh, that was smart. Yeah. He tried to bait him. That was the most bait bait I've ever seen. Yep. 
again, these uh, up smashes coming out, making me think that they might be on purpose. Oh, nice snare. Good. Oh, but he, yeah, he doesn't manage to get there fast enough. Hamlin, and Hamlin covers roll away with forward smash, Ooh. which is not very, uh, not very common. Yeah. Wow, dude. That <laughs> I'm I'm still I'm still kind of thinking about that bear just now. That was so deep. Yeah. We saw him go for deep ones like that against Mojo too. Yeah, definitely. I think MT is very comfortable off stage. Yes, he plays with confidence. Yeah. It's really important. Both, both offensively and defensively, he seems like he's he's all right being off stage. Yeah. Uh, and that's that's a really good trait to have as Marth, because his recovery isn't the best, and his edge guards are great if you're willing to go for them and land them. So. Mm -hmm. Oh man, really rough situation for Hamlin to be in. He manages to get out somehow, but oh man, this is weird looking. And empty again, going for these side beats. Kind of brave side beats. Oh my god, but the leg beats sword. Sheik is the ninja leg girl of the yeah. game. Again, uh, Marth doesn't really have lingering hitboxes, so surprisingly, Bear is not too bad against uh, Marth as long as you can avoid getting nicked by. Good needles, but as long as you can avoid getting nicked by one of Marth's moves, because it's a lingering hitbox, it's actually a really good space control. Yeah. So. Uh, for similar reasons, that's why it's good against Jinx. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it. That was like a better, cooler stomp me. Yeah. And also, oh my god, that grab. Very good DI by Hamlin, but not enough to survive. Yeah, that uh, that turnaround up B is crazy. Super, super strong. Uh, the Roy version will just kill Jigglypuff right at, right at the start of the game. Yeah, although I heard that it's not guaranteed like that. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm not sure. I, I, I just remember Ooh, uh, Seth Hamlin goes like too that. deep. Ooh. Empty messes up. Oh, no! Hamlin fast falls. Yeah. Rip. Looks Hamlin like, played pretty well. Yeah, it looks like Hamlin... It, it always looked like Hamlin had a chance. Um, yeah, it did. But doesn't quite have enough to finish, finish off any of the games. Empty just being a little bit more solid. 